Hey YouTube, it's Laura here with Little Lights by Laura, and this is part two to the really quick video I just posted on how to use the awesome Silhouette Vinyl Roll Feeder that I'm feeling like a crazy lady for not purchasing four years ago. Probably didn't even exist four years ago, but anyway. Um, so this is the second part. This is the software part, how to get it to cut correctly for you. So like I always say, I'm not an expert. I'm learning as I go, but um, I'm so happy to share with you guys as I do. So let's do something um, super applicable to what everyone seems to be doing right now, and that would be those huge welcome signs that people are putting on the front porch. So I'm going to turn my caps on, and here we go. And I'm just hitting enter each time to drop down to a new line. Pretty simple and straightforward. Um, now I'm just going to make this bigger real quick so you guys can see these are all out of line. So we're just going to center them. And I'm just going to go really simple. We're just doing a tutorial. And then so let's do um, 70 inches because um, these boards that everyone are using for them, they're using um, one buys. So it's one inch thick by however wide you want to go. Um, for this example, like if you were making this sign, I would do a one by 10. So I would do 10 inches wide and then six feet tall. So if you're in the hardware store, it would be a one by 10 by six. Um, so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to make my length 70. So see, I'm going seven zero or seven zero point eight one. I'm actually going to make it a little smaller um, so that I can leave an inch at the bottom and an inch at the top. So um, that's that. Okay, so now what I want to do is I'm going to change um, a lot of things under my page design. So first of all, I'm going to change this to 72 inches so that we get six feet. I'm going to zoom back out so that you can see my welcome fits. And then I'm going to go to cutting mat and I'm going to choose none. And if you see here, if you haven't watched any of my other videos, shame on you, no, just kidding. But um, I always choose show cut border because that provides this lovely red line right here to tell you where to stay within your parameters. If I had that turned off and I had my sign like over like this, I'll zoom in even closer. Like say I was trying to be thrifty like I usually am and not waste any vinyl and I cut that out, I'm going to miss cut lots. So if I see, I would miss all of that. So I always make sure that that is turned on. You can still be thrifty and scoot it all the way over if you want, but there you go. So um, it's literally that simple. So there's nothing else you have to do from here other than um, go to your send to silhouette and adjust your cut settings. Make sure that you're on the right um, type of material. I, I just use the vinyl settings that the silhouette provides, which is a blade of one, speed of five, thickness 10. And I have no problem cutting without the mat that way. So I hope that helps you guys. Um, hopefully these videos are super easy for you to follow and understand. Um, and if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to my channel because then you get all of the updates when I post new videos. So thanks so much and have a good night, guys.